The T-21 is the trainer variant of the MG-21 which is a plane that is based off of the real MiG-21 fish bed. This is probably the first plane you flew in the campaign and the very first plane you have to fly in conquest mode. Despite being the trainer of the MG-21, it retains the same stats as the full version of the plane but without any of the special weapons options. When compared to the TF-4, the other trainer, the T-21 has better acceleration and turn rate. I could go on about how you can fly this plane, but since it performs similarly to the actual MG-21, you should refer to the video guide I made about the MG-21. What I will cover is what makes the T-21 different compared to the other planes. It only gets one special weapon and it only gets four of them when selected. I am talking about the drop tanks and these improvised weapons act like fuel bombs, and will perform similar to bombs in general. And just like any bomb, they work on airships too. I just find that they may be weaker than the normal bomb in terms of damage. For where you use this plane, it's most likely you lose this plane in the first and possibly second mission in the campaign before buying the MG-21 or a better plane. If you are a masochist who is actually looking for a challenge, you would use this plane in the higher levels and difficulties. This is especially true to the people who dare use it in Kings on Mercenary difficulty. I don't know how long it took you, but if you did succeed, my hats go off to you, King. As for modules, it only gets flares like the real MG21 and those are especially useful late in the game anyways. Patience is key after all. As for skins, there is only one skin and it makes you look like a banana. If for some reason you don't like the look of it, or really want something else to look at due to lack of variety, then you PC players have the option to download skin mods. Yeah, that's really all I got about this plane. It's a low tier trainer and one of the first planes you fly. Because it's the first, it's also the worst for some players but you shouldn't expect much for a plane that will later transition you to getting a better plane. Remember the basics of dog fighting and you will get the most out of the T21 before moving on. The T21 teaches you how to fly in this game and therefore gives you an understanding of all the other planes that I have covered in my videos. That is everything you need to know in this video. Thank you for watching. I hope to do another one of these guides whenever Project Wingman gets an update that releases new planes. Otherwise, like, comment and subscribe and we'll meet again next time.